So we are in Cambodia right now and um, so the first few clips of this vlog are my first day out with my new team. Um, so in month five there are team changes. Um, it's not because our old team wasn't working out. If anything, my team won polls. Um, we actually grew a lot closer um, throughout the four months we were together and by the end of it we were super close friends, um, but it's just something that our organization AIM does um, every few months. We switch up teams um, so we can get to know new people. Basically, my new team, Rua Shayal, is in these first few clips. Um, I haven't done an intro for them yet. I'm probably do that soon. So during our month by debrief, um, our squad leaders, I think, actually treated us to a day on a riverboat, um, which was super sweet. Um, we got to see Phnom Penh from a riverboat, and then we had some squad worship on it, so that's the new next few clips that you'll see. So after debrief, um, we went to um, our ministry site for the month in Cambodia and we actually went to Siem Reap and our ministry for the month was working with Overflow Guest House. Um, so we got to stay in this really nice guest house with a pool and um, really good Wi-Fi. So that's why I was able to film and upload a lot of videos um, last month. and get a lot of footage up for Cambodia that I'm going to be working on now. Um, so for one of our ministry things, we did a prayer walk. Um, so we went out into the community and um, just tried to meet local people. And one of them was our friend Chai. So our friend Chai actually learned English by watching YouTube videos, which is super cool. Um, so I asked him, if he wanted to be in a YouTube video, and he was like, yes. So um, the next little clip of this video is of Chai telling us um, like who he is and where he's from, so that's really fun. My name is Chai. Yeah. Uh, okay. Hello. Uh, today, uh, uh, very nice uh, to meet a new f uh, friend. Yeah. <laughs> that, uh, she come from uh, USA. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, they are very friendly. Yeah. We are talking a lot. Yes. Yeah. And my name is Chai. Yes, I live in Sibrim. Yeah. And every day I just uh, finish uh, university. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. As we continued with our prayer walk, um, we found the school, and then we found this temple. So we decided to go and pray around this temple, so I have some pretty interesting shots of that. It's really beautiful, even though um, they're worshipping other gods than we do. That's really cool. I feel like you have a school now. Yeah. So we're 
were on a prayer walk and then we found this huge temple. So we decided to go over and pray for it. So next I just filmed a little bit of where we're living for the month, um, which again was really, really nice and we are just so glad to be able to stay over Flow Guest House. Um, it's actually an AIM base in Cambodia um, and our hosts were actually past world racers so they understood us and they had funny stories to share with us and we really loved them a lot, so yeah. So this is the room where you're staying in, in Cambodia. And then you go outside and there's a pool. There's some of my friends waiting for breakfast. And there's lily fields all around us. I wanna show you the sun because it's really beautiful right now. I don't know if you can see that. It's gorgeous. So this is Cambodia, yay! We've actually been here for a little while now, but this is the first time we're filming it. So today we just finished painting the wall of this staircase and I've been chipping away at paint for a few days now with the help of Amy and today Amy, Mallory and I repainted the staircase. So another part of our ministry for the month was um, working with victims of human trafficking. Um, we'd go out at night and go to bars where sex trafficking was prevalent and then we would minister to the women by playing pool with them and just making friends with them um, to eventually connect them with their contacts um, back at the place where we we're staying so a long-term team is coming there soon who might be able to um, find more suitable like long-term housing for them if they want to get out of that industry and um, find jobs for them so they wouldn't have to work um, in the bars at night. Um, so I actually made a really good friend um, whose name I'll leave out for her privacy. Um, but we were able to meet for coffee, um, but I didn't get any clips of that part of ministry because um, just for the privacy of the woman. <laughs> So the next clip is showing um, us walking through the night market and down Pub Street and we did a prayer walk down there while, while um, the other half of our team was in the bars ministering to the women and then we met up with them later um, to minister ourselves. Um, so we kind of split up into two groups so we didn't overwhelm them with six people at first. Um, so it's just one of the strategies we developed over the month. and. Yeah, so I have a sh few shots of um, Pub Street, even though um, I couldn't actually film ministry.
stay a long time? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh I come So I hope you like this vlog. Um, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. That helps people to be able to find it better on the internet. And um, yeah, I can't wait to show you more videos from Cambodia coming up. Yay.